No. You don't need to love animals to be vegan. You only have to have a little bit of more consistency. And remember, that something is legal. Does not mean anything. Being legal means nothing when it comes to the stable of morality. Those have always been broken and always will be broken by people who did see that the law of that time was malignant, narcissistic and oppressing and support the oppressing of disenfranchised group. The laws that protected slave masters from prostitution were malignant, narcissistic. The laws like the ad gag laws of the United started in the United States. They were malignant, narcissistic. The ad gag laws. They were malignant, narcissistic. Protecting the oppressors. The people working in the animal holocaust industry. And silencing the victims. Our gag laws are nothing more than more than slave master protection laws. The first forms of slavery started in the Middle East and started by the first societies that enslaved animals. Of course, because if you are can oppress one group, you can easily oppress another group. Psychopaths start often by murdering animals, like bunnies. Because of their false superiority complex over those creatures, we often dismiss as a society, their sign of an evil person. Like Arthur Schopenhauer did say, cruelty to animals is considered, often considered as a sign of cruel, of a um, sign of a bad character. Evil leads to evil. If you are can Make this world a better place. Start by focusing on the victims instead of the victimizers. Well, so many people have it wrong when they think that if you are a good person, others will follow your lead. Yes, some do. But guess what? Some don't. And those people should be treated the same way they treat their victims. I don't like to say it. But if people are want to cause suffering, if they want to be selfish, narcissistic trash, if they are proud of it, why the frick do you care about them? Why do you not treat them like the way they treat their victims? Let them feel how being to have been a victim in this scenario. I know this view is not popular. Not popular at all in our society. But we do it all. Look to all the people that despise pedophiles and rapists and mass murderers. You judge them. So What's wrong with judging me? Uh, what's, what's wrong with me judging people how rape and murdering or pay rape for rape and murdering too? And when you are against people like Jeffrey Dama, when you are against people like Malcolm Fick, the dog fighter. I probably become very mad on people how they fence those psychopaths. But 
e o Hapley, sem chão da corpo, sem murdered couch. When you are condemning Chinese for eating dogs, he has no consistency, people. He has no morality. Here is arbitrary criteria. Here is bigotry. Ah, oh, yeah. It is called speciesism. Along with anthropocentrism and carnism are the trinity of the first forms of hatred on this planet. We are not important for the whole of the creation. Bees are far more important than us. We are intoxicating a lot of the crops, which kills off a lot of the insects, and it takes up to 25 amount of plant. For a plant um, food, kilo of plant food to create one of, a, say, of cow flesh, for example. So, it is insanity. Animal agriculture is very much not sustainable. And anybody with a scintilla of sound sense will understand it is soundly true. So. Are we going to be sound sense? Or sounds insane.